Hey, what's up? My name is Kristen, and today we are going to plan um, the week of August 15th through the 21st in my Erin Condren Hourly Life Planner. Um, and we're going to be using some stickers that other people picked out for me. So if that sounds interesting, make sure you're subscribed and I'll be right back. Well, before we get into like the stickers we're going to use, let's go over, um, the last week. So as usual, today is Friday and I am filming for the next week on Friday. So let's kind of go over what last week looked like. I kept um, the stickers that I was using, the leftovers in here, so that if I needed to change things, I could um, and add things, and I did. I ended up moving around some things. I did have a lot of these like checklist things, um, with some school things on there. Um, and then that was because I had already like paced out. It's um, the thing I'm doing, it's teacher certification and it's all self paced. And so I paced it out what I thought I, you know, could reasonably do. And um, then I decided towards the beginning of this week that I wanted to speed it up. And I wanted to make finishing those courses a priority. And so, um, I ended up changing it like majorly. I was gonna take the whole month of August and September to do them, um, but now I am slated to finish in the next week. So yeah, I'm really, really speeding it up, trying to get through with it. So I did move a lot of those and I added a ton more um, courses in. And actually I, right before filming this, just finished this course. And so these are just in, in the order I need to take them, not necessarily on those days. Cause obviously today is Friday and I just did this one. So these are going to be some of the ones I take the rest of this week. And then I'll start some of those other ones for the next week, I believe. I'm not really sure, I can't remember. I think I might be working on these throughout the weekend. I don't know, we'll see, I have it written down somewhere. Yeah, <laughs> it's somewhere. Anyhow, I added some checklists or some things to do here um, and I did most of them. We didn't have any errands and um, I did not do my power hour. And in fact, I didn't do any zone cleaning this week because I've just been focusing on my son's school and my school. That's all we're doing right now. Th these are important things and my floors are dirty, but um, they're just gonna get dirty again. Even if I did take the time to clean my floors, they were just gonna get dirty again. So we're just gonna pretend I cleaned them and then they have already gotten re-dirty. How about that? All right, so let's turn the page and let's talk about the stickers I'm gonna be using. I'm so excited for this. This is um, my friend Lena from Lena Patterson Plans. Um, reached out to me and um, Yvette from the Planner Mom, the Planner Mommy, um, and she suggested we each send each other some stickers to use to just see how we use them. And so everyone picked out the stuff we wanted to send each other, and um, now this is my plan with me where I'm going to use their stickers. So um, first I'm gonna go over, before I show you all the stickers, I do have my dashboard here where I've kind of pre-planned a little bit what I need to write down and keep in mind as I do my plan with me. And then this is just like a little shopping list that I guess got bundled up in that um, stack of stuff. Um, this is not gonna get written in my planner. I don't know why it's there, but hey, that's what happens. I write stuff on little pieces of paper like this. This is the back of one of those um, desk pads from Erin Condren. Um, and yeah, I just cut them down to this size. And then I write stuff on them and then I lose it. So eventually when I get done with my stack of these little scraps of paper I have, I'm gonna probably try to come up with a new system because I always lose those, those little scraps of paper. Okay, so now that I'm rambling, let's get started. I have, first we'll look at these. This is a kit from Sweet RT Designs and Lena sent me this. It is like a little pink lemonade kit. Um, I really like the colors and I'm excited to use them, use these stickers. I really like this and this, and I might even try to use this double box here. I'm not really sure. 
Um, I don't know, we're gonna see. I'm not gonna use the washi, I don't think, um, because I think I'm just gonna, I'm, I'm gonna need the space in the planner. Um, but it's there if I need it. Um, I'm not gonna use these glitter headers because I'm just not a glitter header person. And I did go ahead and take one of my um, leftover date cover sheets. This one's from Orange Umbrella Co. And it had the dates on it that I needed. And they actually fit perfectly in the little squares on these date cover boxes. So I went ahead and pre pre did that. And then I also wrote in the, the videos that I'm gonna have this week. Um, there's also some things on here. Most of these things I'm probably not gonna use just because like we know, we've talked about it so many times, I'm just not a habit tracker. I do like this little doodle box. I might try to figure out how to use that in some way. There's some deco on here I'm gonna try to use. Um, I'm not gonna use these checklists because there's a whole page of these ombre checklists. So, um, well, no, I might, I might use them in the sidebar, we'll see. And then we've just got some more functionals here. Another, like this could be a habit tracker or even a water tracker, even though there's only seven hearts, but whatever, you can do, do whatever you want. Um, we've got some icons. And then these headers are nice. Um, I definitely won't use all of them. Like I know traditionally people like to um, put them in each section. Like if you had a vertical planner, you could use these like today to do and whatever. Um, but I, I may use a couple of the to do ones or a couple of the today ones. And then there's also like these, these would actually be really good in my um, sidebar here. And then of course these like half boxes or are those, I don't know, I don't use a vertical anymore so I can't um, judge whether those are half boxes or third boxes or what. And then of course, like I said, these, um, these ombre checklists that I'm gonna use for um, my power hour, maybe I'll do it this week coming up, maybe not. And then I think I'm gonna use this for um, my courses that I need to check off as I do them. Okay, so this is the kit from Sweet RT Designs that Lena sent me. Well, Yvette also sent me a whole envelope of goodies and this is my favorite thing she sent me. She sent me this sheet of random stickers that she collected and she put a note and it said, good luck with this sticker sheet, mwahahaha. And you know what, Yvette? I'm using it, because guess what? It matches the kit Lena sent, so joke's on you. <laughs> anyway, um, and then um, she also sent me this set of half boxes, and there's like a yellow one and like a pink one here that I think might go well. So if we need extra half boxes, I'm gonna try to use, <clears throat> excuse me, I'm gonna try to use those. So I'm gonna have those available and ready to go. And then of course I've just got my, all my functional, like the icons and scripts that I may or may not need. So let's get started. I did say I'm not gonna use any washi most likely, but I am gonna go ahead and put these date covers on because this kit conveniently matches the August colors, which I'm so happy about. And I am just going to put the date covers because they're made for a vertical, like a standard vertical style. They're not gonna cover up the whole yellow strip here on my hourly, but because they coordinate, I can go ahead and just line them up with the bottom of like the printed text and then the yellow will show through. So it'll be just kind of like I put a little strip of washi down and we're just working with what we have and it will look cute and still be functional. Okay, I'm not sure if those are crooked or not, but that's okay. So um, I actually didn't really like prepare a topic of conversation for today. Sometimes I'll like think about some stuff I wanna talk about and then um, as I'm laying stickers down, I'm like, hey, let's talk about this and let me get this off my mind. Um, I don't really have anything today. I do wanna say thank you to everybody that um, contributed to the discussion about like apologizing. Um, if you didn't watch my last plan with me, um, that is what I'm referring to. Um, I spent a good chunk of that video talking about how I don't think we need to be apologizing for some of the things that we tend to apologize for. And so, um, wow, that looks really good. I'm really happy with that. Okay, um, and, but this time I just didn't, I don't know. 
I guess I've just been thinking about school so much that I just haven't really thought much about, um, I don't know, other things. And so I don't really have anything special to talk about today. I'm gonna use these green YouTube icons from Planner Kate. Um, I have them here in my little binder and I don't think you can see that. I'm pretty sure that's off camera, but that's where I'm, what I'm getting these from. And they match this green color, which I'm sure you can't see that little heart, but it's the same color here. So, all right, so let's lay those down and I am gonna put them on the nine o'clock spot because I do typically um, post my videos, schedule them to be live for 9 a.m. And I'm actually putting them between the 8.30 and nine just to, I don't tend to use this space for a lot of things, so I'm just trying to maximize the space below it. Um, so this video here is the plan with me that you're watching. This one is um, the new Erin Condren Family Organizer book, which my previous video was my haul, where I, I kind of walked through the whole book and um, some other things that I got from Erin Condren recently. So, um, you could go watch that one before you get to this one if you haven't watched it yet. And then Friday, I think, and I hope, will be a vlog. I gotta be honest here, I'm not sure that vlogging is for me. <laughs> it's hard to make, to be mindful of recording things and being like ready to hit record on my like phone or whatever while I'm just living my life and doing things. And sometimes the vlogging definitely does make it harder to get anything done. And like this week, my intention was because it is like back to school week and it was busy with um, school and just cooking dinner and cleaning the house and everything, my intention was to vlog about that and show you what it was like. Um, but guess what? It was really hard. Um, it's been a struggle this week. Um, and so vlogging kind of, I don't know, we're gonna, I'm gonna spend some time like this day editing the vlog and I'm gonna see if that's worth a whole video. If not, I don't know, we'll figure something else out. Um, also, as you're watching this, the previous episode, episode, I keep saying that, um, <laughs> it's not an episode, it's a video. I used to film Minecraft um, gaming videos and those were episodes because it was like a story that I was telling. Anyway, um, the previous, previous week's videos, um, I did do a little bonus video. So there were four videos last week. Um, but I don't know if I have anything in the queue that I can move up for Friday, but we'll see. There'll be a video. I just don't know what it is yet. If it's not the vlog, we'll figure it out. All right, um, I am gonna pull this out and we're gonna see. Let's put down um, dinners and let's, I did like using these like half boxes for dinners. Um, but this time I am gonna put them, um, I'm gonna put them in the six o'clock hour because Oh no, I, okay, so here's the other thing. My son is starting his tennis lessons and they're Monday through Friday at 6 p.m. and they're an hour long. So I don't know, should I put like a piece of washi, which I don't have. I can use this one that came with, um, came with Yvette's little sheet of doom here. Yeah, that's the only, cause this washi is too, way too thick and I don't want to deal with cutting it down. And plus, if I don't use it, it will help tie together the remainder of this kit for future use. So yeah, I am gonna use this, but I also need a functional that says that I can write tennis on. And I have forgotten to order a script that says tennis. I think I have said in the past couple of times I was gonna, um, oh wait, here. This is how we can use that doodle sheet. Sorry, I am, here, this, okay. So um, I have said I need to order tennis scripts and I just keep forgetting. So let's see.
Okay, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to put that at the 6 o'clock. We're going to use this washi. Um, I'm going to actually put the washi at like the 6.30 mark. Okay, and then we're gonna put this bad boy right here. Okay, and then we're gonna put the rest of the washi on this side, and it's only through Friday, so we don't need Okay, so that's down, and then we do have this little piece of washi in case we need it for something else. Alrighty, alrighty, we're getting going here. Starting to get in the groove. Um, what else is a recurring thing? Let's see. So I did say I was gonna do dinners. I could go ahead and write those like I said I was gonna do. What do we have that we have enough of that are similar? I think these are gonna be the only ones that I have seven. Yeah, okay, so let's do um, the ones that look like the lemons and then we'll alternate. So we'll do four lemons and three of these stripy ones. And we're gonna have bean soup. This is one of our favorite bean soups. I wrote soups, oh well. <laughs> it says soups now and that's what it's gonna have to say. Salsa chicken. And these are both crock pot meals. Um, the chicken can be used in any way and we'll just decide that day if we want it over rice or if we want it as tacos. I'll probably eat it as like a taco salad. Um, spaghetti. Um, tuna, I didn't alternate, what the heck? I meant to alternate. <laughs> now they're gonna be, Okay, whatever. Let's do, um, how can we do this? So there's three on this side and I can do these four for the other side so it doesn't look so weird. I mean, I could white it out. I'm not gonna white it out. This, this happens, okay. Um, tuna casserole, I have on the menu, but we're having spaghetti. I don't think I thought that through. We're having spaghetti on Wednesday and tuna casserole on Thursday, and those are both pasta, and I'm trying to not, um, not eat a ton of pasta. I do eat gluten-free pasta, but still, um, it's, I tend to overeat pasta, because I love it. Who doesn't love pasta? Fend for yourself night, pizza night, and uh, lemon chicken. Hey, lemons, I'm gonna put a little lemon, um, a lemon icon on here. Lemon chicken, all right. Now let's do our weird, I meant to alternate. Why didn't you tell me I wasn't alternating? <laughs> Bean soups. Um, salsa chicken. Spaghetti. I think I would prefer to write these. Like I did last week, I had them already written. I think I would prefer to write them ahead of time instead of writing them on camera. It's just, it's faster, my table doesn't shake because I can write them on a different table that's more sturdy and um, I don't make f awkward mistakes like I did here. Pizza and lemon chicken. And I did say I was gonna use some of the de deco. There is a lemon, there are lemons. There's lemons here and here. So let's do this little lemon. Um, let's, yeah, lemon chicken, okay. Can you see that? Am I still in frame? Okay, good. Okay, we are making a mess here. I did bring my other planner. That's why um, we kind of have like a crammed space here. Um, my daily duo has my monthly like to-do list and stuff like that. So 
that's in there. Okay, I can do my comments here. So um, comments will go on Tuesday, Thursday. I do my comments like the day after the video goes live because it's easier for me. I love to um, read every comment and respond to every comment. And so I do have to you know, make time for that. And it's turned out that it is easier for me to make time to where I can actually like be present and engaged and, and actually like give thoughtful responses to your comments. Um, it makes it easier if I just do it the next day and then I can sit down and do them all at once. Um, whereas when I was trying to do them the day the video went live, they would like trickle in over the course of the day and then I would miss some and then they wouldn't get answered until the next time um, I had a video go live. Anyway, I just prefer to do it the day after. It seems to be working out pretty well that way. Okay, what else can we do here? Um, I do usually put the little comment um, icon on there because I have them and if I don't do it, then I never will. And we're gonna do some pink ones on here. I'll just put it here. I don't really need to check it off on here because I check it off in my daily duo. We'll do the yellow one on the pink guy. And then we'll do the pink one again on the yellow one. Alrighty. See, this is working out. I really like the, um, the colors here. I have to be honest, I would not have picked this kit. If I were shopping, I would not have picked this. Um, I don't know why, I, I just think I'm not one to, I don't know. Like I tend to do like these kind of more softer colors, I feel like, like they're more muted. And I think the yellow and the green in this are very saturated, but it works, so like, this is cool because it's it's showing me that my maybe my first impression of something isn't always going to like like it's not I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> what am I trying to say? Like if I if I see something and I'm immediately like, "Oh no, I, I don't know if I like that one the best." That might not be the actual answer that I'm looking for. Um, okay, so the next things I have, um, we have trash days and we have, um, what else? I'm gonna use, let me just go ahead and do the trash days real quick. Trash days and recycling. And I'm gonna use the green planner cake. They're just like the, um, they're the little BW icons that planner Kate does. And they have the green heart, just like the um, YouTube icons that I have. And then I'm also gonna do the recycle one. Here's one here. Okay. All right, all right. And um, so what else I have on here? I have that my mom's birthday is on Sunday and there is a happy birthday in here, I thought. I know when I was looking at this, I saw something about birthdays. Didn't I? I'm not making that up, am I? Oh, it's a cake. It's a little cake. And then is there something for birthdays on here? Like a balloon or anything like that? What are these tiny little, like, they look like, you know, Pez candy. They look like Pez. <laughs> They're so small. Okay, um, let's use one of these little flag dealies and then let's get that birthday cake. And do we have another like half box I can use? No, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use, I'm gonna go and do something interesting and do kind of like build my own like label and I'm just gonna put mom and I'm gonna put that up at the top of Sunday. And we'll put the little flag dealie there. And then where did my cake go? Here's my cake. And then the birthday cake, we are gonna just put right there. Okay, all right, I like it, I like it. 
Mm, I got tennis. Um, I do need to write that I need to pay for tennis. I need to send money with my kid to pay for tennis. And on here, there's a little dollar sign, but I thought I saw a stack of bills, dollar dollar bills. Okay, here it is. Okay, these are yellow. So let's put it on one of these pink ones. Oh, there's also these pink ones. I'm gonna use these because I wanna use up stickers off of this sheet faster than those because this will go with the kit. So let's put, um, I'm just gonna put tennis because that little stack of money. Um, I'm gonna put it down here by tennis because the money needs to go with him to tennis when I drop him off. I guess there was like a bill due. I could have done a bill due. <laughs> Why didn't I do that? I could have just did a bill due like this and wrote tennis and then still have that little check spot for whether or not it was paid. But like I said, I'll check off things in my daily duo anyway. So it doesn't necessarily need to get checked off here. I'm not sure how I feel about this um, being lower than this, but I don't know. We're gonna go with it. Um, filming days. I film on Tuesdays and Fridays and I typically use those half boxes. And like I said, I, I use them all wrong here. So we're gonna go with these. And we're gonna do the sideways thing like I always do. If I can find all my icons, I'm gonna keep using the green icons. I'm gonna just build it right here on the sheet. Um, I'm looking through, I use my, the little, uh, what are these, laptops? Yeah, I use those to indicate editing and uploading. And I did move all of those scripts into my book here. Yeah, okay. Film. I'm almost out of film. Okay, I definitely need to get my, I need to check out my cart. I keep forgetting. I have a cart full of stuff for Orange Umbrella Co. And um, I keep forgetting to check it out. Um, I get distracted easily. <laughs> so I need to go hit go on that. They're pretty fast to ship, so I bet they'll even get here before I need them again for next week. But even if not, that's okay. I have one film left. <laughs> and then I could just leave it blank and then add the stickers later. Okay, so those are in. And then I also need to do my Facebook post for, um, can I cover that? No, I'm gonna use one of these. Yellow, I'm gonna use the yellow one. Okay, let's just put this here first so that I know where to put the half box because I like to do that before I start filming and everything so that um, it's done and I don't forget about it. Facebook, and then don't I, I'm gonna use the little, um, oh, they're right here in front of me. Post Facebook stuff, okay. And then we have our film edit upload. So, let me see, I have kind of changed around the times that I'm doing everything because I, um, like I said, I'm doing school. And so I am trying to see what time I wanna do all this stuff and make sure I am allotting the right amount of time for everything. All right, so I'm trying to decide if I want to actually put like each course and what time I'm planning on taking it or if I just want to have like a, a list of the courses I need to do that day. I think the list is a better way to go because I tend to be optimistic about what 
I can get done during that time period. And then sometimes I either go faster um, and sometimes I take longer or I just don't get to it. And so I think just having a checklist is probably better. Um, let's do this. And then I think there's a planner time or a planning sticker, something that says planning, planner time. I thought there were two of them, but maybe not. Maybe I'm making that up. I'm, I wanna do all the courses. On, I wanna write them on these checklists and I wanna do it like last. Because I think once I get everything on here, like event wise, then I can like really see if that's um, realistic to try to do that many in one day maybe. But um, I think really all I have left is the zone cleaning and then the courses. So let's get that down so we can get this going. Um, I'm going to use this here with one of these little like scalloped things to indicate what zone we're in. So we're in zone three and I'm going to put, I'm kind of putting it off to the side in this box because there's another script with the kit that says, um, it says specifically clean house and I want to be able to use that. I'm also trying to figure out if I'm going to be able to fit this where I wanted to fit it. Um, I'm going to, I'm going to overlap. Look, we're going to do something weird. Um, bear with me. I can move a sticker if it's terrible, but let's just try something here. Because this isn't for Monday or any specific day. This is just to let myself know what zone we're in um, for the week. Where did I put? Here it is. Clean house. I'm going to see if I can't put this. Okay, it's overlapping the Monday a little, so maybe that wasn't the best idea. Maybe that looks terrible or crowded or something. Okay, if that bothers me more, I can move it. But this, the zone three is going to be um, my kid's room, which he was actually cleaning it this morning before school for some reason. I guess he got sick of it. <laughs> um, and then bathrooms. And then the guest room, which is not gonna need to be cleaned, but I'm writing it on here anyway so that I can check it off because I'm not gonna have to do anything with it. <laughs> and it'll feel good to check that off. I'll get to win on that one. <laughs> All right, and then let's do our um, power hour list, which I am gonna put on Wednesday because I am gonna try to do it on Wednesday. Um, so power hour is always dust, mirrors, vacuum, mop, um, piles and trash. And um, I didn't think about the fact that we are, we only have five here and I should have combined um, vacuum and mop as just floors. But um, I'm gonna take off piles because that's kind of something I'm not really struggling with. I'm not struggling with trash either, but I do wanna collect it so that it's easier to put out in the morning. Piles, we don't tend to have a lot of piles, so I can leave that off the list. And I'm gonna put that down here. All right, and then what about a little header, the little power hour header I have? And I can put it on one of these little skinny things that came on Yvette's sheet. Does that even show up? It shows up enough and it's crooked, but. Oh, I wonder if there's icons for cleaning on here. There's like a vacuum cleaner. Uh, let's try this before we ruin the stickers. Here we go. I was looking for an icon of like a little spray bottle or something. Oh, 
Oh, I could have used this too clean. That's okay. All right, well, that's it. All right, so now let me write in my courses and I am going to, you know, do the little time warp thing. Okay, so what I have here, I thought about putting, breaking it into the days that I wanted to try to get those courses done, um, but then I thought better of that and decided to just make a list of all the ones I need to do in order. Um, and then I had some extra space here and so I just put another task. I have to schedule some um, observation hours where I go observe classrooms. I have to have, um, I have to do some in person and then there's some in online I can do um, where I, I just observe that and then answer some questions um, from like videos. So I'm going to put this on Monday um, because that goes through Wednesday. Like if I were to do it in the way I scheduled it out on my calendar, um, I would be done with these at the end of the day Wednesday and then these I'm gonna put on Thursday because um, that is when I will start doing those. And actually I'm gonna move this up one so it's not it's not so like heavy in this department down here. Okay. Um, I don't really have a you know what I do? I was gonna say I don't have a school header, but I do. I actually used them last week. These came in a, um, like a Misfit Monday thing from uh, Planner Kate. And so since I didn't like purchase these like specifically, I always forget about them. So I'm gonna use this green. Um, I think I'll put this green over here cause there's not much on this side. I'm gonna just put it right up against that sticker and then let's use the yellow over here. Okay. All right. I don't have anything over here for the weekend. Um, I think I'm okay with that. <laughs> um, I think normally I'll do my little like bath time, which I can still do that. Um, there's a family time. There's a Sunday fun day, but we don't, we don't do Sunday fun day. Just because we don't do anything fun. <laughs> We're not against Sunday fun day. We just typically don't. We all like watch a movie. I can put this little movie marquee. Um, and I can write like whatever movie maybe we want to watch this weekend. Um, I can do, I can put some of this deco down. How about that? Let's put some of the deco down or do we want to use a box? I did say I was going to use this and now I don't really feel like I have a spot for it. Um, so I am going to, I want to get some more green over here. So I'm going to use this one. And I'm gonna put this box like right here. Or maybe I should put it more like right here. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right, well, let's do the sidebar and then see what happens after that to do. And I'll just line it up right with the top line. I just kind of left it a little bit of breathing room there. Um, let's use one of these heart checklists and hopefully it lines up. Oh no, I'm gonna have to lift up that sticker. I don't know that this lines up. 
it's slightly off, but that's okay. This bottom heart is like going into that next line down, and then this top heart is going into the next line up, but that's okay. Um, let's just pull this up and just do that. And I don't really like how that's like overlapping, but I wanted this checklist to be as far to the left as possible, so I have space. Um, so let's see if we can't find something small to cover that up. Let's use one of these little asterisks. Sure, that works, okay. Alrighty, alrighty. And then the next little list we can make here, um, do we have errands this week? Where's my thing? I did write down things we need to make sure we do. I do want to, we have some things I need to purchase, which I may or may not be able to order online. I do need to drop off donations. So I can do a little, um, a little errands checklist, I guess. And then like the one before, I'm gonna not put this down all the way since the checklist is going to show just like it did. I should be using my tweezers here so that I can see what I'm doing. Can you see what I'm doing? I don't know how far I am. Okay, well, that's fine. And then we'll use the little, um, you know what, there's a car, but the car is yellow. There's a pink car on this sheet, so let's use that. Eh, it kind of works. Okay, um, I think I'm done with all of these. I'm just going through one more time and see if there's anything I can use. I will get Happy Mail because I need to order those stickers from Orange Umbrella Co., but I don't know what day those will come because I haven't ordered them yet. And um, I definitely don't need that anymore. I'm not using that. I'm not going to use those. I'm done with those. And I don't think there's anything on here that I need. I could do my little like dinner thing that I normally do. Let's see, do I have scripts that say dinner? Oh, you know what I need to do? And of course I kind of ruined it. Both of these are crock pot meals. I could put the little crock pot script I have um, right there. Let's do that. These um, set crock pot. Um, let's use this yellow one and this pink one. Really, I should have them if up here, like to remind me to do it at the beginning of the day so it can cook all day, but that's okay. Set crock pot. All right, and then I'm just gonna write these in later because I can't like, I don't wanna sit there and write them all on this little edge. It's gonna be weird. Um, and then the one last thing I said I was gonna do, and then we'll be done. Thank you for watching this long. <laughs> I'm kind of like all over the place as usual, but hey, that's how I plan. If we haven't figured that out yet, I don't know if we're paying attention. Um, let's use the green one. Let's put the green one here. Let's put the dinner here, and then the last, last little thing we're gonna do is get the arrow icon to point. Oh, we have a green one. Oh, it's not really the same, the right shade of green. Um, let's, whoops, let's use this one. I don't know, this came off of a sampler sheet somewhere. All right, okay, I think that's it. Um, I am gonna fill these in. You'll see them next week when we um, get to this week's plan with me and go over what happened. Um, and that is it. So thank you so much to Lena 
for sending me this cute kit and look at how much I have left to use again or to pass on to somebody else. There's so much left. This is like a really full kit. Um, yeah, so thank you, Lena, for that. And then thank you, Yvette. Look at how many stickers I used. Okay, it's not that many, but I used the washi. I used some of these functionals and icons. Um, and then there's like, you made it seem like this was like a disaster, but a lot of these stickers go together, so. I don't know. These even go together. Look at that, the greens match. Anyway, we could keep going on and on about this, but thank you Yvette at the Planner Mommy and thank you Lena at Lena Patterson Plans for sending these awesome stickers and look at how cute this turned out. Um, let me know what you think about the spread and if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and if you really liked it please consider subscribing um, i post plan with me videos every monday and then other planning and lifestyle videos every wednesday and friday so um, i will see you in the next video bye